Here in Australia, we're losing a lot of canola out of the back of our harvesters. And in Western Australia alone, I've estimated that we're losing $90 million a year worth of canola. That equates to about $70 per hectare over our 1.2 million hectare crop. This canola grain or any grain that's left on the ground after harvest is your profit. And in some cases, it might be all of your profit. Canola is a high value crop. It might be twice the value of wheat and we're losing more canola than we are wheat out of the back of a harvester. So we're losing a lot of a high value crop. So we need to measure it. We need to measure it because we want to at least halve these canola harvest losses around Australia. We're in a farm in the northern wheat belt of Western Australia where the grower has swathed and then harvested. And as you can see, we've got a narrow windrow here and somehow in this lot, we've got to find our canola harvest losses. It's like finding a needle in a haystack. We're looking for a very small seed in a large amount of material. We really believe that there's almost no point in looking on the ground looking for canola because the seed is so small. I've personally been a bit vocal about getting the harvesters to slow down to minimise losses. And that's one lever that we can pull, but that's the last resort. We really want to maintain capacity and keep the losses at an acceptable level. So what is acceptable loss? Well, 1% is the internationally accepted figure. We want to be below 1% for most crops, cereal crops. However, canola, often it's in that two to 3% range. I think we can do better than that in the long term, but if your canola losses are below two to 3%, you've got it about right. As part of this project that I've been working on with GRDC Investment, I've created a Twitter handle for you to come and share your experiences. It's called at harvest loss. What we want to do is measure our harvest losses, get on that Twitter handle, share experiences, we'll put our heads together and work out how to halve the canola harvest losses in Australia. To measure it, there are some new tools that you can use that make it really easy and we're going to show you those tools because as the old adage says, if you don't measure it, you can't manage it. <music>